<laughs> Meet okay. Kelly is tonight's video. Hello. My name is Jodie Bunting and this is our free six week course where our slimmers are going to be losing a stone in the next six weeks. Ladies and gentlemen, meet Kelly. Hello. Hi. 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 So let's tell everybody how I know you, first of all. I went to work in Egypt like 16, 17 years ago, and I met this lovely person called Kelly, and here she is now. <laughs> it's so strange. Do you miss those days that we used to have working by the beach? Yes and no at exactly the same time. So I'm probably going to say either Ness or Yo, putting them together because... I'm too old for that now, but it you you look back and the, the memories are so fond and the the crazy times and being in charge of a coach full load of people, showing them the sights and pointing out of the window and saying that's the hotel, the one with the lights and 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 really just enjoying it. But yeah, now I'm a teacher, so I teach eight and nine year olds, Ooh. and I just that seems like a long long time ago. Well, it was. 17 we definitely, years we definitely don't miss doing the 20 hour days do we that's for sure no definitely not all <laughs> very late nights and then getting up really early the next day and being super professional <laughs> <Absolutely not. laughs> great right so welcome to our six week course where you are going to lose a stone i'm going to make sure it's going to happen um how has your weight and your health been affected since the last time i saw you has covid really thrown a curveball what's been the issues do you know this sounds ridiculous and rehearsed but it's not my grandma always said laugh and grow fat meaning <laughs> when you're happy you put weight on and i feel like that is really true because during COVID, myself and my husband were both working. So our life didn't really change that much. We we're both key workers. Yeah. Um, so I can't blame that. Um, <laughs> we got married 12 years ago. And just before we got married, I actually lost three and a half stone to get married. And being a normal size, I don't want to be skinny. That's not me. Yeah. You know, I've, I'm quite he heavy up top and it always will stay that way. Yeah. I'm voluptuous. I just want to be healthier. My dad's not very well at the moment. and. I just feel like I want to be healthier. I obviously want to slim down a little bit and be able to not worry about putting a certain size dress on, whether it's going to fit or not. I'd like to be able to think that's my size. It's going to fit in most makes and brands because we know they fluctuate as well. So, yeah, it's more about being healthy. And I think because I, I, I'm so busy at work all day, I tend to not eat until I come home. Uh -huh. So I don't touch anything because I feel like I don't have time. So when I come home, I feel like I've earned anything I would like. <laughs> Obviously so, doesn't work. <laughs> so school yeah. dinners are not an issue for you then? Um, yeah, I, I, I like to stay in my classroom once my children have gone outside. I don't go around near the staff room very often because I like that quiet time. Yeah. So because I'm in the classroom, then I do jobs. Whereas I think one of the things I should do is just leave the school premises maybe and go for a walk, do something where I'm away. And yeah. I know I need to eat more in the day and that sounds ridiculous, but I know I have a, a un, an unhealthy re, a regime in terms of when I eat, definitely. Yes. So just trying to eat more regularly um, is going to stop you from overeating as well. Because at the moment, what's happening is because you're starving yeah. yourself all the way through the day, you're literally coming in ravenous and it's really hard to prepare a food and take time to make something nice when you're really hungry and all you want to do is eat, isn't it? So Absolutely. definitely. What sort of things do you think we could get you to have at lunch times? Well, today, because I knew that I was going to be talking to you, I thought, right, I'm going to eat something. <laughs> and I, I just had crackers, salt and pepper crackers, the little ones. Yeah. Some of those with a tomato that I ate like an apple and some okay. strawberries and um, like a light cheese spread on them. When I eat, I'm not actually, except at night time when I've now, because I'm almost 45, I've got a sweet tooth. Never had a sweet tooth. Oh, really? absolutely no sweets biscuits ice creams cakes nothing like that as soon as I turned 40 now as soon as I eat anything I'm like hmm, I just fancy a little something <laughs> and that happens in the evening 
and I'm like, oh, well, I can have that because I didn't eat today. Yeah. And again, so if I could cut out sweet things, that'd be quite easy for me to do. I think also saying that, well, let's see. <laughs> and what sort of things are you eating in the evening? I will eat an, a healthy meal because I we do sometimes we do the you know uh, is it gusto sometimes oh, yeah. do that it depends on my husband's hours so he's now just changed from doing um from finishing at half past midnight every night except the day that he's off to now he's got fluctuating shifts which is amazing because when he's home before me we're cooking so we're cooking right. fresh up it isn't really the actual things that I eat. He will have rice pasta. I'm not really keen on them. They're boring. So yeah. we'll do a chicken dish or a fish dish. And then I'll, I will have vegetables because I like all the vegetables. So I'm quite lucky in that respect. Perfect. But then I want an ice cream afterwards. Then maybe something a bit salty, like some crisps. And then I may start thinking about supper. Okay. <laughs> Never had supper in my life till I turn 40. Now I have to have supper before I go to bed. <laughs> no idea why so this so, yeah, is definitely because your body hasn't had the nutrients all day and it's just crying out for nutrients in the evening so hopefully yeah. just putting that lunch in there will stop this supper this supper um habit that you've got into um have you tracked with my fitness pal before the app okay no. so what i want you to do is to track your foods using the app have you counted okay. calories before yeah, I okay. when I lost the weight for my wedding, um, I was on Weight Watchers. I do know the points of lots of things if I know what points I'm having. I think my thing is, at the moment, I'm not accountable. Yeah. So, so this for me will, I do believe, work because I'm accountable now to you and everybody else. Yeah. So, and I do, I'm very competitive, number one. <laughs> and number two, I don't want to look silly. So I would, I would try my very hardest because I want to do it so that you can give me a sticker. Yeah. Oh, you are it's a teacher, aren't you? Through and through. Oh, definitely. I am. I am. I have to be accountable. And I'm not. My husband loves me. Doesn't matter my size. My yeah. children at school love me. Oh. We don't have children of our own, but I have my children at school, 30 of them. They yeah. adore me. And so nobody says to me, except for myself, and you don't stand there looking in the mirror every day, do you? You yeah. literally make sure you look okay to go to work. Yeah, you, you hardly really stare at yourself. There's no one to say to me, right, make sure you do it. Now, and when now it comes to meals, <laughs> when it comes to meals, there's two things that I want you to try and do. Make sure you yeah. always have protein with every meal. Yeah. So obviously like meat, fish or nuts, seeds, avocado, something like that. Something with some good nutrients in. And then yeah. also with every meal, make sure you've got a portion of fruit, vegetables or salad, which it sounds like you do anyway. So you yeah. quite enjoy those things, don't you? So that's yeah. fine. But yeah, just make sure you've got the protein there as well. And that will also stop your blood sugars going from up and down. We want to get you off that sugar roller coaster that you seem to be on in the evening, which is making you eat till quite late. Yeah. Yeah. Great. Does that sound OK? Yeah, absolutely. Have you got any more questions? No, my husband works at Tesco. He's buying me, you know, one of the water bottles because I buy them all the time, but they just break. So he's getting me a really good one because I know I need to drink more water because I drink coffee, quite a bit of coffee. And obviously that dehydrate. Yeah, something like that. Great. I'm going to. Yeah, uh, again, if, you, recommend. if you can put it on your desk at school, that'll be fabulous. Because we want it. to try and drink more water in the daytime. So if you have it in the evening, then you'll be up all night weeing. So it's important to make sure you get your water in in the and daytime. I can leave it at school. Yeah, yeah, I shall do that. Brill. Perfect. Right. Okay. So we will see you next Tuesday evening. And like you said, okay. you are competitive. If you want to win the course and be the biggest loser, <laughs> then feel free, <laughs> Kelly. Oh, you, you I'm just it. being really honest because I'm so bad. I'm known in my family. I'm the Monica. Like rules make it fun. I, oh, I, I love some, Monica. Oh uh, yeah, I think that's why it works. I'm super organised as a teacher. It's just it's part of who I am. My family embrace it, but sometimes, particularly if alcohol is involved, um, they can get a bit annoyed with me. So, because if you don't, you don't play a game unless you're going to follow the rules. Fact, simple as All that. All win. <laughs> well, absolutely. 
Okay, so I shall do wow. that. And I'm looking forward to a catch up. Great. Right. I'll Hopefully see you I'll next be week. like this. Yes. <laughs> in one week. Jodie can make you look like this in one week. That would be great. Oh, fabulous. Thank you so much. Right. Thank you. And I'll, I'll speak, speak to you next week. week. Thank you. Okay, doke. Bye. 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 bye, bye.